Okay, um, so first of all, Cameron, thanks very much for accepting this special request. I just want to show you a slide on Chagas disease. That is this one, just to, um, I mean, uh, we at the Pan American Health Organization are fully aware of the great challenges that the uh, efforts to reduce the burden of Chagas disease have, has not only in the region, but also nowadays with the globalization of Chagas disease in the world. However, we have had some achievements, and uh, to give a, a rather positive note, I would like to show just this slide uh, in a minute. So as you see, seven endem 17 en of the 17 endemic countries in the region have interrupted the vector-borne transmission by the primary vector species in part or whole of, the ter of their territory. Actually, the countries in the southern cone, most of them, uh, the countries in Central America and the countries in the Andean region, some of them ha have interrupted transmission in at least in part of their territory. Uh, 21 endemic countries are implementing universal screening for Chagas disease in blood banks. We have had an increase in diagnosis and treatment of congenital Chagas disease in most countries, and actually we're starting to develop a strategy for reducing uh, congenital Chagas disease in our region. Um, and we have also had a gradual increase in coverage and quality of diagnosis and treatment for Chagas disease. As you can see in the graph in the lower uh, right uh, corner. And these are some of the figures that we have by, uh, for comparison between 2005 and 2010. You see a reduction in all of these figures. These are PAHO estimates based on information that countries provide to, con to, to PAHO. So I uh, just wanted to show this to highlight some of the achievements. That is not to say that we don't have a lot of challenges that we need to address. Thank you very much.